They're asking for additional funding from the state legislature and local tolls. Andy Brown joins us live from the Free Store Food Bank at just one of those. Uh, they're one of the organizations rallying. Good morning, Annie. Hey, good morning. Yes, I'm here at Free Store Food Bank. This bus is headed up here to Columbus in just a few minutes. I'm here with President and CEO Kurt Ryber. Now, can we talk a little bit about why this rally is so important? It's a critical need right now. When you think about the higher prices of the grocery stores, uh, the increased demand that we're seeing, uh, we need additional dollars so we can buy food for families from Ohio. But the, the, this is a win-win situation. We buy food from Ohio farmers to give to a hungry Ohio Ohioans. Uh, it makes uh, all the sense in the world for the state uh, government to support the Ohio Association of Food Banks. We have 12 food banks serving the entire state, all 88 counties. There are, you know, just here in the tri-state area, one in five of our neighbors don't know where the next meal is coming from. And that's an increase uh, from years ago. We were one in six or one in seven. So right now, the time is more important than ever to get food to these families so they can stabilize their lives and really make a, a difference uh, for their children and our community. And what are you all requesting from the state legislature? What we're asking is that the, the Ohio House put in $15 million increased budget financing for uh, the purchase of food. We're asking the Senate to you know, put that money back into the budget so that we're not flat funded again this year. Uh, because if we're flat funded again this year, that means that a lot of Ohioans uh, will be, have to do, go without because uh, the food banks across the state will just not be able to keep up with the demand and the increased pricing. Yeah, you said there's an increased need statewide. Is there a specific reason for that? Well, it really, the, the rationale is because we've just spent the past three and a half years digging out of a pandemic. Uh, we had people that were laid off. They've burned through their, their reserves. So right now they're deciding, do I buy food or do I pay my rent? Do I buy food or do I buy medicine? And right now those are tough decisions that nobody should have to make. What we're asking the state legislature to do is to reinstitute the $15 million into the budget the House already put into it, make a difference for our Ohio uh, communities, and really make a difference for everybody uh, so that everybody can have a hunger-free, healthy, and thriving community. Awesome, Kurt. Thank you. Thank you. All right, and that rally begins at 11 a.m. noonish today, guys. All right, Annie, thank you. And you can learn more about today's Rally for Ohio's future by clicking on the Get It Now links. Our time now is 842. There's new information about the missing submersible.